In this demo, we'll cover how to create a shared project so you can work with your team on the same file at the same time. To create a new shared project, use File, New Shared Project in the main menu. Or to convert an existing RP file to a shared project, go to Share, Create Shared Project from Current File. This will bring up the Create Shared Project dialog. In the first step, enter a name for the shared project. Next, choose the directory where the shared project will be created. This directory is frequently on a network drive or SVN server and should be accessible to everyone who will be working on the shared project. Finally, choose the folder where your local copy of the shared project will be created. This is the copy you will be using to work on the project. Click Finish to create the project. After the shared project is created, there will be an rppr.j file in your local directory. Whenever you want to work on this shared project, open this file. You will notice a number of changes to the XRP environment. The icons next to the pages in the sitemap pane and the masters in the masters pane show if you have the page or master checked out. To make changes to a page, master, or project property, the item needs to be checked out in your local copy. Keep in mind that checkouts are per local copy and not per user. If a page is checked out, the icon changes to a green circle and you can make your edits as usual. Unlike pages and masters, the sitemap and masters list can be edited without being checked out. This makes it possible for multiple people to add and organize pages at the same time. The project can be saved to your local copy using File Save. When we're ready to submit our changes to the shared project, we can check in a page by right-clicking on the page in the sitemap and selecting Check In. This can also be done in the toolbar above the wireframe. When you check in, you can add notes about the changes you made. Notice that Home is still checked out. After the page is checked in, others can get the changes to their local copy. You also no longer have the page reserved for editing, and others can check out the page to make their changes. Now let's switch over to another person's computer, who will also be working on the project. To start working on a shared project, the computer you are using must have a local copy of the project. To get a local copy of an existing shared project, use Share, Get Shared Project in the main menu. This will open the Get Shared Project dialog, where you will locate the shared project and create the local copy. After the project is retrieved and opened, you can see the project we created and the changes to the login page that were checked in. Now let's try to check out Home and Visit. Home is still checked out from the first computer, so we're shown a warning and given the option to edit the page without checkout. This is called an unsafe checkout and is not generally recommended since it can result in overriding other people's changes. So we'll continue without checking out Home. After making some changes and adding a new page to the sitemap, let's use Share, Check In Everything to check in the entire project. This ensures all our changes are added to the shared project. Now, going back to our first computer, we can retrieve any changes to the shared project using Share, Get All Changes from Shared Project. Notice that the changes to the visit page and the new page in the sitemap are now there. We recommend that you frequently get all changes and check in everything to make sure you and your team have the latest changes. To see the current status of items in the shared project, use the Manage Shared Project browser in the Share menu. Clicking the Refresh button shows you which pages and masters are checked out. You can also right-click on an item or selection to check in, check out, and get the latest changes. You can also see a history of the revisions to the shared project using the Shared Project History browser. Set a date range and click on the Get History button. If you ever need to get a previous version of your project, you can export the RP file. That concludes the Shared Projects demo. If you have any questions, email us at support at or tweet us at ActureRP.